Disney Pixar Wall E. It's 2805 and Earth is covered with garbage. A company called By and Large helps send all the humans to live in space on the giant star liners. They also built robots to clean up Earth, but it was too much work for the robots to do. All the robots broke down except for one, Wally. He is a waste allocation load lifter, Earth class robot. All day he crushes garbage. And collects interesting things. Wall E likes cleaning up, but he's lonely. One day a spaceship lands on Earth and drops off a robot named Eve, an extraterrestrial vegetation evaluator. Wall E is fascinated by Eve. He watches as she scans everything with her blue laser beam. Eve is looking for something. Later, Wally and Eve finally meet. When Wally sees a sandstorm coming, he grabs Eve's hand. And leads her to his storage truck home. Wally shows Eve his collection of treasures, like a light bulb, videotapes, and some old toys. When Wally shows Eve a leafy plant, he found Eve gets very excited. She scans the plant and puts it in her storage compartment. Then Eve shut down, shuts down completely. Wally can't wake her up. Wally cares for Eve while she is shut down, but soon the spaceship returns to pick her up. As the ship blasts off, Wally grabs on and watches Earth disappear below as he follows Eve into space. He does not want to lose his new friend. Wally hangs on as the spaceship lands on the Axiom. A giant by and large starliner. Humans on the Axiom have become very lazy. Robots are programmed to do everything. Go for it. A robot assistant takes Eve away. Wally secretly follows M.O. A scrubbing robot sees that Wally is very dirty. He chases Wally, determined to clean him. Gopher brings Eve to the Starliner's captain and the autopilot named Alto. The captain hopes the plant that Eve has brought back is real. Then he will know Earth is livable again. And the Axiom... can head home to Earth. Auto reactivates Eve and the captain opens her storage compartment. But the plant is gone. Eve knows where Wally is hiding. She glares at him, thinking he took the plant. The captain decides Eve is malfunctioning, so he sends her to the repair ward. While he sees the repair bots taking Eve apart, he thinks they are hurting her. So he grabs Eve's blaster arm and accidentally shoots a hole in the control panel. All the robots in the repair ward are freed. While he and Eve try to escape while the sirens 
go off. Eve knows the Axiom security robots will chase after them, so she must get Wally off the ship. She tries to put Wally in an escape pod, but he won't go. Another robot is coming, so Wally and Eve hide. They see Gopher put the plant in the escape pod. He's the one who stole it. Eve apologizes to Wally. Then Wally hops into the pod and tries to get the plant. But the pod blasts into space. Inside the escape pod, Wally panics and presses the self destruct button accidentally. Sirens blare. But Eve zooms into space and rescues Wally. When he re when she reaches him, Wally shows Eve the plant. He saved it. Eve is completely overjoyed. A spark of electricity passes between the two robots like a robot kiss. Now they have to get the plant to the captain so he can set the axiom on a course for Earth. Eve wants Wally to wait near an opening in the garage chute while she flies up the chute to see the captain. Eve sneaks onto the ship's bridge. She proudly gives the plant to the captain. He's excited to see it because he wants to go back home to Earth. The captain activates Eve's memory chip to see what she recorded on Earth. Eve watches the projection as her chip replays how Wally took care of her. She realizes how fine she is of Wally. E. The captain needs to take one more step to send the axiom. Back to Earth. He must put the plant inside the ship's hollow detector. The hollow detector will scan the plant and make sure it's real. Once that's complete, the axiom will change course and head home. Suddenly, Otto orders Gopher to take the plant. Years ago, Bion Lars sent a secret message to the Otto telling, telling him never to let the Axiom return home. Earth is just too dirty. Meanwhile, Wally crawls up the garbage chute to find Eve. Just then, Gopher tosses the plant into the chute. Wally grabs the plant and brings it up. But Otto sends a shock through Wally and fries his circus. Then Otto stuns Eve and has Gopher toss her down the garbage chute with Wally and the plant. In the garbage bay, Eve wakes up and uses her blaster arm to break free from the cube of trash. She rescues Wally as M.O. Holds the airlock door open. Wally is badly hurt. Eve frantically tries to repair him, but she needs parts from Earth. Now she has a new reason to get the Axiom home. The Axiom tilts as the captain and Otto Fights for control of the ship. The captain activates the hollow detector on the Lido deck and sends Eve a message to take the plant there. Eve races off with Wally and the plant. Wally is still hurt, but he really wants to help. When they arrive at the hollow detector, Otto tries to close it down. Wally jumps under the hollow detector and holds it open. But the heavy machine is crushing him. He finally gets the plant. Into the hollow detector, it scans the leafy green object and sets the axiom on a course for Earth. 
Eve turns to Wally and finds him completely shut down. She holds him gently in her arms. The Axiom finally lands back on Earth. Eve tries de desperately to fix Wally. She gets him working again, but Wally is not himself. He doesn't recognize Eve and begins cubing. Things around his trailer truck home. Eve is very sad. She rests her head against Wally. Then a spark passes between them. It's a robot kiss. Suddenly, Wally comes back to life. He's the Wally she knows again. Eve giggles with happiness. Eve and Wally sit atop the storage truck, watch the captain lead everyone off the Axiom. One day soon, Earth will be clean again. <laughs>